Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Bite of Whiskey and more Fallout Frost. Where last time we found Recon Bunker Theta. We were a bit of an asshole there, I guess, even though the people attacked me. Um, and ended up killing some people that were there. And we ended up just kind of exploring around the area. But also... Killed yet another <laughs> flipping sentry bot. I'm getting real tired of running into these things. This time, what we're going to be doing is we're going to continue looking around this area and then head back. We may need to actually head all the way back to Valenti Station soon because we're going to be running out of uh, supplies, more or less. We're low on alcohol. I <laughs> need to make a run places. Okay, so we don't have much in the way of ammo. We'll start off with this. Now, I think I know about where Outpost Zamonja is. Should be roughly in that location, and then there will be Ten Pines Bluff there as well. So I want to go ahead and get those markers. I don't know if Frost or Frost Plus added anything into it, but it's worth looking at. It is not an incredibly foggy day today in Frost, so I am very, very thankful for that. That is a random ghoul. Just a reminder for anyone who may not get to the end of the episode, we will be implementing streams into the content soon. They will be on Monday and Wednesday. I still don't know 100% if they are all going to be on Twitch or if they're going to stop poisoning me. Or if they're going to be on uh, YouTube. We'll figure that out kind of as we go along. Where'd you go? There we go. Got him. All right. That's probably really bad me. But yeah, that is something that is going to be happening. Is that another flipping sentry bot? We don't have the ammo to deal with that. So we're just gonna sneak on past that. I did not make a supply run. Um, I did not go back. We are picking up directly from where we left off. So, it's kind of, kind of a break from how we've done this normally. Normally, in between episodes, I'll run back home get supplies, and then we'll move on from there. Not this time. This is going to be a continuous loop. Okay, there is Zamonja. Can we sneak up on it? There is a survivor. Okay. Got him. Got a combat rifle. Oh, sweet mother of God. That's not happening. Around this corner. Let's use this. Fuck it. Oh. That is not working.
Come on. Thank you. And Mr. Power Armor took the hell off. Yeah, we were right there. We were right flipping there. I knew that was really close to Zamonja, but it was so damn foggy I couldn't see. Thankfully, with that assault rifle, we know exactly where Mr. Power Armor is, and doubly thankfully, he does not... He does not have the fat man. Oh, she, this time. Oh, we broke her! We broke her physics. Ooh, Rolf's journal and a flare gun. Rolf's journal. I dreamt I was climbing the belfry of an ancient cathedral. Above me climbed the, chimed the bells as if to warn me of some nameless horror lurking outside. As I made that final ascent, pulling myself to the summit and peering out over the balcony, I saw a city consumed in flames. I can see it now in my mind's eye, flickering like the candle before me. Surely this is a bad omen. I don't know who Rolf is, but I guess he saw the end of the world. Okay. Ten, pli Ten Pines Bluff is in the area too. So there was some lore here. That's pretty cool. It's nice to see that uh, we don't have any flares. Let's just drop that. It's nice to see that even some of the outposts um, are getting some love. I don't know if I want to go up into that because I think we did see another sentry bot 556 five, rounds are always going to be welcome though especially while we're out and about it's a nice little shack oh that's just rocks Man, it feels good to be able to see, though. <laughs> Just having visibility outside of 30 yards is a plus. It is such a plus. Like, I can see that wolf way over there. I'm not gonna kill it. We're fairly good on food, so I don't need to. I mean, it's, if it comes at me, I'm gonna kill it, which it probably will. Oh, there's two of them. Three of them. I think that's it right there. There's the rad roaches. And the non-hostile settlers being held hostage by rad roaches. But we will save them. Surprisingly not a glowing rad roach. I don't really have anything to say. That's fine, they don't need to. You know, in just base game, living out here in just that shack, that seems hard enough, right? But then you're gonna add frost to it, there's no way they survive. Now, I do wanna be, yeah, a little careful in this area, cause I believe that bears can spawn here? I swear I've had bears spawn here. Well, whatever was searching for us is long gone. Okay, this is Ghoul City up here. Yep, you can see him shambling around. Not too much of a threat, but free XP. Now, the problem with ghouls is, of course, they can swarm you. That's right, your turn. 
Rad X? Thanks. Oh, I mistimed that. Okay. Oh, that's a lot. That's a lot. Okay, hold on. Oh, God. Oh, they just got three very clean hits on me. Ah. All right. Okay. Not bad. Gold watch we can sell. Oh, Braxo. There's a ghoul. Nope, nothing. Okay, toothbrush. Don't really need. Instructions, huh? What that is, we'll read that when we get up in here. Just blood. Deliver your package to the old switching station. The scaver arrives at midnight. If you need gear, look for the blue barrel. Ah. Blue barrel? Now I don't know if I want to wait and literally wait here until midnight. If you need gear, look for the blue barrel. That's a blue barrel. Nothing. Sorry, blue barrel over. This is the switching station, right? I don't see the blue barrel anywhere. Hmm. All right, well, either way, let's get in a sidetrack. Let's get on the road and head up it. I just wanted to kill some ghoulies. Thicket. I think you can do thicket stuff. But I don't know if it's particularly worth it, right? Got it. Nice. Mintats, nice. Yeah, I don't know if let's do this. You don't have to. What just happened? You don't have to. Stop it. Stop it. I said not to. Yeah, I don't know if Thicket Excavations is particularly worth it, to be honest. Um, I don't know. Maybe we'll come back to it. Okay. Cooked up everything we could. We are going to need... We are going to need water, though. That's gonna be something we need. Alright, um, yeah, there's Sanctuary. You see... You see what's going on in Concord. Doesn't say we cleared it. There might be some booze we haven't gotten. checking those at least maybe there's booze there um i don't know if after you drain it the uh raiders drop booze and um that would of course make it relatively worth it to do it except for the fact that you have to kill everybody which is going to drain your sanity in order to get the booze so i don't i don't know excellent yay we can get tattoos fedex
Pierce Concord. A Kim's vendor? Well, hello! All right. That's welcome. Hey there, sister. You looking for chems? Yes, drug me up. Let's see what you have. This is all I've got at the moment. I really don't care. Oh, look at that. Mentats. Give me mentats. And I will sell you... Where's my junk? Oh, you won't even buy anything but that. Huh. That's not actually bad. Um, but yeah, I'll take your men pads. Alright, Conquer, do you have a scary death claw for us? Some of the loot has definitely respawned, which I'm not mad about. It's been a while since we've been here. not a bad pipe rifle. Do I have a level up? I do have a level up. Okay. Oh, this is the new system. Okay. Um. Oh, these are some of the new perks with, uh, with Frost Plus. As long as you're saying Fist of Frost, Subway Runner, on the edge. 20% against normal survivors, but not against NPCs that belong to a specific Slayer of Metal Men. Oh, this is kind of cool. Hold up. I don't know if I want armor or that. Um, strong back 2 wouldn't be bad. You know what? I'm going to take Lead Belly. I'm taking Lead Belly. So that's, that's cool. That's more like the... Uh, that level up system is more like the old uh, fallouts. Oh, you lived, you son of a bitch. Hold up. I unequipped my Molotovs. That was a terrible idea. Booze? Hey. Okay, hold up. Oh god, they all look like Malden men. Okay. Hmm, bandage. That one hit actually kind of hurt a little bit. Alright, let's see. Oh, come on, please don't. All right, then. Found my hit. Oh. It's called fear. It's called you're dead. It's in here. No real reason we need to stick around here. We can just, uh... Actually, let's just head south. Although, actually, we could repair our armor at the Red Rocket. This is about there. And I don't think we've even gone to the Red Rocket because last time it was, we've been a long way and it was full of ghouls and right now ghouls are like our best friends. They may make us, uh, sick. I don't know if I have enough antibiotics for them. But you know what? That's, that's XP and crap we can kill that won't make us insane. And I'm okay with that. And that looks like it right there. So we can just kind of head in this direction. So long as we don't run into anything too damn dangerous, we should be good. Just give them a berth. If they come after us, we'll defend ourselves, but I'm not going to go looking for a fight like we just did and stuff. 
I'm gonna get comments about that. Oh, there's a fusion core in there too we could check out. All in due time though. Ghoulies! Where? Oh, you thought. Oh, that one poisoned us, didn't it? Yep. Okay. Unfortunately, the doggy is not friendly. Once you leave and come back, the dog will go hostile. So, you don't get a dog in Frost. That's not a thing that happens. No, tin can, cabinet. I actually won't mind grabbing every damn thing to try and fix up my power armor. That's, that's not a bad idea. Just everything. And what we don't need, we can just store again. All right, let's try and fix this up, fix that arm up. Okay, let's get some, uh, let's get some water. Parasites and weakness. Let me go ahead and finish filling everything up and then if I've got an antibiotic, I'll take one. Where's my dirty water? The janky way to get things places. I can literally telekinetically carry this. Okay, that was the music. Ooh, that got me. That got me. Okay. Okay. Now. Do we have... We've got one antibiotic. Okay, good. Hi, dead dog. I'm gonna eat you at some point. Okay, now round back. We've got a uh, place that's got a fusion core. I'm gonna check out. Should be some rats in here. Be plenty of fungus, too. All this could be fungal purge or fungal moonshine. Oh, that's an actual mole rat. Here it is. Rats. Trash buster for 10 millimeter rounds. There's the fusion for it. Alright. Got what we needed. All right, let's point that way. That is damn near across the map. All right, I guess we'll pick that up next time. Not too much going on. Um, just kind of exploring the northern waste a little bit more, picking up some supplies. We've got a whole lot now. We are loaded for bear. We need to get all this back to our temporary base. One big thing we've got to figure out is where do we get that password for Recon Vader, or Recon Bunker Theta? We're going to need that. We need to resupply our ammo, our, you know, meds. We may be forced to uh, retreat back to Valencia Station. I don't know. We'll figure that out next time. I am just going to be on my way home to Reap's Marina. If... Yeah, that'll be it. I hope you all enjoyed. If you have, please remember to like and subscribe. Leave a comment down below. That feeds the algorithm and helps the channel grow. Hope to see you all next time. Y'all have a wonderful day, and goodbye.